All right, we're going to go to Taruk Makto Village. Well, that's what I call it anyway. Avatar is good. Um, they are nine caches out here, boys and girls. And I know what you're thinking. I've only seen six. There is nine. I will show you the hidden three because I know you probably know the six, but I will show you the hidden three. So let's hop off this plane and make it happen, Captain. Let's go. We got three surrounding this back body of water. We got two surrounding the other body of water. We got company. So probably not going to be able to get all these and live, but we're going to try. That's one. Just trying to make a video. That's two. Can I just please make the video? Or well, let's hope. All right, so we got the other one over here. Take his money, because he took ours. We're gonna come around and here's three. He took all that out of there, but that's the third one. We're at the 6550 and let's keep going up to the other uh, body of water up here. Got one right here, there's four. Then we're gonna run over here. There's five. All right, let's go to uh, six. Six is right here. All right, we're up to 14,006. All right, we're gonna to try to make it out here. So now this is this is the secret three, okay? The secret three are right up here on this ledge. Usually you take a car if you have a car. There's no car, so I'm gonna to try to hoof it and beat the gas. We'll see, I might not. All right, there's number seven right here. We're gonna come out and get number eight right here. And then number nine is tricky, and I'm gonna die getting it, but I wanna show you guys. It's right over here. Right there, in the gas. But that is number nine. All right, that is nine caches you get with the Taruk Makto drop. That's $20,000 in cash, and a great drop for a squad or solos, as you can see. Um, let's hop into the next location, and we will see what we can find. All right, this drop we're gonna do for all Shurim Pass. It's two of the lakes you can hop into. It's great for regain, it's great for a quick loot. Let's take a look, I'm gonna show you where to go. Go on the mini map, you're gonna go right here on the pass. These two body of water right here where you wanna go. Let's take a look and see what we can get there today. All right, let's see what we can find in this lake. There should be a cache at the bottom of this lake and the other lake. Uh, remember, you don't get any fall damage or break your legs when you hit the water, so don't worry about doing your shoot. Let's see what's in this one. That's a three plate. Let's go check out the other one. This one should be right over here. Up oh, there it is. Let's see what's in this guy. A mortar. 5,502 caches. That's a quick regain caches, guys. So. Keep in mind when you're coming back from the gulag, it's quick, easy money at all Sharim Pass. All right, let's take a look at the next one. All right, we're gonna go to Hydro Electric. You might recognize this map from Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer. This is a quick money grab and uh, it'll help with regain. You can get it off the rip in solos and duos. I wouldn't recommend it in trios and quads, uh, but let me show you where the money is. It's uh, buried underneath. We got a lot of people coming here, so we will see if we can get it.
Remember, the water doesn't hurt you. Here's step one. Then you're going to go down and through this tunnel right here. You're going to go down this one. Don't worry, you won't run out of air. It's right there. Get a gun, get that, get that, get that. There you go. Quick little 5,000 bucks. Easy to do. All the way at Hydroelectric. Run it back if it went too fast for you. Let's go to the next location. All right, let's land in and get these nine caches. One's going to be right here as we land. Right by this tree. Get loaded up, get our gun, get our mortar strike, get our plate. There's one. Going to run right across to number two. Get some more. Gonna run right across, get number three. See, it's right here. There's the first three and we're up to 7,500. Now we're going to go to the next three on the other side of the cemetery. All right, we're going to come up to this tree right by the house. You'll see the glowing thing right here, right in the cache. Get that one. Get another there, get another there. Then you're going to turn and you're going to go right to this car. There's going to be another cache here. That's number five. Off this UAV. Got one guy here. Just so we know. Moving. Target marked. All right, then we're going to come over here. That was number five. We're going to come over here and get right behind the tombstone. We're going to get number six. So that's number six, and we are 13 grand in. Nice little start. Now we're gonna go get the next three. Right up here at the radio tower. It's gonna be number seven. Number seven right here. So we're up to 16.5. We're gonna come straight across from the rail tower, straight across right here for number eight. Cash. Got another UAV. We're gonna pop that. Doing pretty good. We got one guy here. That's number eight on the caches, and we're up to 17,000. Not too bad in this area. This is a great place to land. Eight, seventeen thousand dollars so far. Let's go get number nine. It's going to be right behind this mountain. We got number nine right here. Last and final cash right by this wood piece. That bad boy up. So we got $19,000 in cemetery. Great start. Nine caches. All right, let's go take the next location. All right, this drop is perfect for regain coming back from the gulag or starting off in solos or duos. You're going to have three caches here. One beginning, one at the middle of the island, one at the end of the island. We're going to go right here and I will show you where they are. You're going to want to drop here. Um, usually you can get four to seven thousand in cash, a couple of streaks, weapons, vests, you know, all the fun stuff. So let's take a look and see what we can pick up today on our cash shopping list. We are going to fly right in and we're going to go to this one right here. And, but this is where it's at. So at least you can know there's someone's already gotten it. So there's nothing to get there. Let's go to the next one. I'm going to go to the middle over here. Oh, there's some backpacks. Let's see. Perfect. Nothing in those. All right. Other cash over here. Oh yeah. Look at that. A couple. Look at that. Play box. Got that. Got a gun. That's a nice little, that's a nice little pickup. And we're going to go over the third one right here at the end of the island. Three little caches over here. The three little caches that could, really. And this one hasn't been touched. So we're going to take a look. We've got a UAV, tear gas, riot shield, you know, all the essentials when you're playing Call of Duty. Let's pop that little. Yeah, nobody over here. 
So that is the three on this island. That's the best way to pick them up. Good for regain, good for solos and duos, um, and a quick, easy gain. Now the other ones, the other one was taken, so I don't know how much money was gonna be into it, but I usually pick up four to 6,000 in cash. So let's move on to the next drop spot. All right, this one, we're gonna go back to the airstrip. I know a lot of people in my community gave me a hard time for missing one of these. So we're gonna go through and make sure I get them all this time. I appreciate everybody in the comments letting me know. Make sure I don't miss them this time. Let me know if I do. But let's hop down and take a look. And I will get all of them this time in a hope we're going to see. All right, let's start the back here and get the first one right here. Got a little, little riot shield. Go over to the next one. There's number two. It's right over here on the sandbar, right on here on the side, right there. Right, we got three. Gonna come back along the side here. So we got, let's count a plate vest. We got a couple uh, airstrikes and we got, you know, a riot shield. Cause everybody needs that. All right, let's get number four right here. There's number four. Let's get number five. Right here alongside the water. There's five. Something tells me I might need that Strella. All right, we'll go across the water, get number six. We're gonna go across the water and get number seven and eight. Let's get number seven first. All right, number eight, number, I'm sorry, number seven right here. And then let's go across and get number eight. And number eight, number eight right there. That is all eight at airport. That is all eight at airport. So you guys can't give me a hard time. I got them all. And we got 14,500 to spend at the buy. And that's a good little nice drop for you. We got people over here too. We're gonna just keep. Those are the top six hidden loot spots and we covered them. We got them all. We got some new ones in there. We got some old ones in there. Hydro's fun, Swan Island. That's what I call the one all the way out in the three on the island. Um, as always, hit that notification bell so you know when I go live. I stream live every Monday at 8 p.m. Pacific. And then also hit that subscribe button. We appreciate all the subscribers. We're about 1,100 subscribers deep, and I love and appreciate all of you. I'll catch you in the next one. we got a lot more content coming for season two, so let's get after it. All right, guys. Thanks.